Imagine being able to detect the slightest shift or deformation in a structure, whether it's a massive bridge or a tiny piece of machinery. Welcome to the world of strain gauges. Now you're probably wondering, what exactly is a strain gauge? Well, in the simplest terms, it's a small yet mighty device that measures the strain or deformation of an object when a force is applied to it. Imagine pushing a ball of clay. It changes shape, right? That change is what we call strain. Now, these gauges are like our super senses, detecting and measuring the strain with remarkable accuracy. They're commonly attached to objects like buildings, bridges, and machinery, silently monitoring and recording the tiniest changes in their structure. So, essentially, a strain gauge is our window into the unseen world of forces at play around us. Now that we know what a strain gauge is, it's time to unravel the mystery behind how it works. Imagine a rubber band. When you stretch it, it becomes longer and thinner, right? Well, strain gauges operate on a similar principle. They are made of a very thin wire, or sometimes a thin foil, which is attached to a flexible backing. This wire or foil is designed to stretch or compress along with the object it's attached to. Here's where the science comes into play. This stretching or compressing changes the electrical resistance of the wire or foil. You see, electricity flows more easily through a short, fat conductor than a long, thin one. So as the strain gauge stretches and the wire or foil gets longer and thinner, the electrical resistance increases. Conversely, when it compresses and the wire or foil gets shorter and fatter, the resistance decreases. But how do we measure this change in resistance? That's where a device called a Wheatstone bridge comes in. Without diving too deep into the technicalities, this device is essentially a circuit that allows us to measure the change in resistance very precisely. By connecting our strain gauge to a Wheatstone bridge, we can measure the voltage output and from that calculate the strain experienced by the gauge. So, let's put it all together. We have our strain gauge attached to an object. When a force is applied to the object, it causes deformation, stretching or compressing the gauge. This changes the electrical resistance of the gauge, which we measure using a Wheatstone bridge. From this, we can calculate the amount of strain, allowing us to understand the force that was applied to the object. In other words, strain gauges translate physical deformations into electrical signals we can measure. Ingenious, isn't it? From the car you drive to the bridges you cross, strain gauges play a crucial role in our daily lives. Indeed, these tiny devices are hard at work in industries ranging from aerospace to automotive, and even in the sports equipment we use. In the aerospace industry, for example, strain gauges are used to monitor the structural integrity of aircraft during flight. They help detect any deformations or changes in stress levels that might compromise the safety of the aircraft and its passengers. On the road, car manufacturers use strain gauges to optimize engine performance. By measuring the strain in different components of the engine, they can make adjustments to improve efficiency and reduce wear and tear. This not only makes the car run smoother but also extends its lifespan. Even the sports gear we use is designed with the help of strain gauges. Ever wondered how manufacturers ensure that your tennis racket or golf club is up to the mark? They use strain gauges to test and optimize these equipment for better performance and safety. By measuring the strain in different parts of the equipment during use, they can make design modifications to enhance durability and improve the player's game. So whether it's ensuring the safety of an airplane, improving the efficiency of a car, or helping you hit that perfect shot in tennis, strain gauges are at the heart of it. Strain gauges, thus, are the unsung heroes ensuring safety and performance in countless applications. Like any technology, strain gauges have their set of challenges, but they also have an exciting future. The accuracy of strain gauges can be influenced by several factors such as temperature variations, material properties, and the difficulty of calibrating these delicate devices. For instance, a slight shift in temperature can cause the metal in the strain gauge to expand or contract, leading to inaccurate measurements. However, these hurdles haven't stopped our innovators from pushing the boundaries. Recent advancements have introduced wireless strain gauges, eliminating the need for physical connections that can be cumbersome in certain applications. Furthermore, we're witnessing a surge in the development of flexible strain gauges that can adhere to curved surfaces, expanding their utility in a variety of fields. From the microscopic world of nanotechnology to the colossal structures of civil engineering, strain gauges are evolving to meet the demands of modern applications. 
Despite the challenges, the future of strain gauges looks promising with advancements that are pushing the boundaries of technology. Strain gauges, small as they are, hold a significant place in the world of modern engineering and technology. These tiny devices, capable of measuring minute changes in force, are integral to various fields from aerospace to sports equipment. Despite challenges like calibration and environmental factors, advancements in strain gauge technology continue to push the boundaries of what's possible. So, remember, the next time you cross a bridge or drive a car, there are probably tiny strain gauges working tirelessly to ensure your safety. Stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of science and technology.